So Christ is king, does that violate Tawheed verbally? You said it, you said uh, it draws attention, it's provocative. So now you lean towards, you want to satisfy the audience. My priority is I don't want to violate anything in Islam. He's correct, but it's misapplying it. Islamnet is raising funds to establish a masjid and community center in Norway and they urgently need your support. This donation will be a sadaqah jari for you because every person that comes a step closer to Allah through your donation, you will inshallah be reaping the reward. Click the link and donate what you can. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh brothers and sisters and dear friends. So Sneeko, Sneeko is a new Muslim who is uh, getting to know the Dawah scene, getting to speak to different brothers, alhamdulillah, he met me, Muhammad Hijab, uh, Aki Ayman and many other people, alhamdulillah. So he's in Dubai and he wants to meet a few other people, subhanAllah. And he happens to come across Faris. Obviously, he doesn't know much about him, uh, so it was just normal just having a conversation with him. But obviously, knowing Faris, and I'm sure everyone knows Faris, I'm fasting as well, uh, so obviously I don't want to uh, fall into backbiting. But we guys know Faris, we know Faris for um, <clears throat> uh, laughing at the situation, uh, what's happening in Gaza, somebody who uh, blames the Palestinians for what they are going through, uh, somebody who, when it comes to the issue of boycotting, just mocks and laughs about it, like, you know, it's not a big deal at all, you know, it's comfortable living in Dubai. Somebody who has not said a single word against Israel. I wish I was on a sneak or stream i would have asked him to ask uh, faris hamadi if he can condemn israel I would love to see that. But anyway, so what does he do? Uh, instead of meeting Sneeko and, you know, uh, giving him some reminders in the sense of, you know, just, you know, he's new to the DNA. Oh, no, 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 no. He has to get straight to the refutation mode. Uh, sticks on him. Why? Because he said Christ is king. Um, I said the same thing as well. Yeah. And he accuses him of saying words of shirk. Like again, I'm fasting now. I don't want to fall into uh, backbiting. If I'm fasting or not fasting, the last person I would give my good deeds is to Faris. Uh, so Sneeko, we spoke to you and we told you about a group of people who have an issue with everybody. He's one of them. Here is the video, inshallah, guys. Let's watch for ourselves and see what was his issue with Sneeko and what's his evidence that the statement Christ is king is shirk. How the hell is it shirk? I'm the jahil ignorant one. You're supposed to be the knowledgeable one here, yeah? You are the, supposed to be the knowledgeable one, yeah? How the hell is saying Jesus is king? And I'm, I'm going to say, Jesus is king, yeah? And when he comes back, he will rule, yes? And there will be peace. He will be the king of all kings on earth, yes? On earth, on earth. There'll be rulership, his rulership, which is the Sharia of the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. He'll be following that and he'll be ruling, yes? So how is saying Jesus is king? Yes, I understand to say king of all kings without giving context saying on earth or whatever. I understand, but he did not even and say that so let's watch for ourselves inshallah and see what's his evidence to claim that to say jesus, jesus is king uh andrew tate said and him said makes him commit go against tawhid like you can't make this up i think everybody has their their method in this in this war against shaitan yeah so i'm sorry but you okay, just proving prove what we were talking about right social media is a two-edged sword so christ is king does that violate tawhid verbally not intentionally your intention you don't believe christ is the king of kings because huh? you wouldn't be muslim if you say that Absolutely if you believe not. that and i don't believe that no. yeah but you said it mm -hmm. that is a violation no, he did not say it. Where did he say Jesus is the king of king, all kings? He did not. Where did he say Jesus is the king of all kings? You said to him, you don't believe Jesus is the king of all kings. He said, no, I don't believe that. Yes, then you said, yeah, you said that. No, he didn't. And like you said, intentions for an action to be accepted, a deed, you have to have the correct intention and the action has to be according to the sunnah. Okay, his intention was there. To, for him to say Jesus is king, I don't understand. How does that, how does that to deify him? So for example, uh, Christians say Jesus is sinless. Yeah, that, that, that makes him God. So if you come and say, oh, Jesus is sinless, does that mean now he has said statement, statement of kufr? Because they believe it's sinless is equation of equating to God, only God can be sinless. Yes, so the, uh, for them saying, oh, Jesus is sinless, and I say, well, yeah, Jesus is sinless. And they go, oh, you see, you said, well, thank you. Yeah, you believe Jesus is God. No, I don't. So I don't understand. Let's carry on. So acts of worship has two components, has intention and act. The intention should be correct and the act should be correct. You can't say, oh, I have my intention right, but my act is not right, it's okay. At least my intention is right. No, it's not, Islam is not like that. Because if you open that door, then anybody can do anything and says, my intention is right. Why are you judging me? Why are you saying it's wrong? Where do you draw the line? Yeah, where do you draw? Yeah. So no, acts of worship or anything that's talked about in Islam or in religion has to have these two components that are right. And so, He's correct, but he's misapplying it. He's correct. Actions, intentions have to be there. Yes, so I can't intend to give dawah and then go to a nightclub because the actions that are following are not according to the sunnah. Yes, then if I go to a specific place where I want to give dawah, I don't extra, uh, whatever, but my intentions are for to show off, again, it won't be accepted. So he's right, but he's applying it to the wrong place because Sneeko never said Jesus is the king of all kings. And so uh, you said it, you said uh, it draws attention, it's provocative. So now you lean towards, you want to satisfy the audience. Sorry, I'm not like putting on the spot or anything. No, 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 this is, this is good. Yeah, but. But if you, if you say no, I don't want to provoke anyone because first of all, my priority is I don't want to violate anything in Islam. If I don't violate anything in Islam, then yes, I can serve or fulfill my audiences. True. And he's said nothing that violates anything in Islam. He did not say anything that violates in Islam. What did he say? Jesus is king. Look, I'm saying Jesus is king on earth. Okay, he's going to be king. Or Jesus is king, like I'm just glorifying. Yeah, if I said Jesus is the king of all kings, then I'll say, whoa, what does I say? Jesus used that very specific word. But he did not say that. I don't get it. 
I don't know, curiosity or whatever, that's fine. But then here's the line. So Christ is king. No. You have to first ask yourself that. Does that violate anything in my priorities as a Muslim? Yes, I'm not going to say it. But, but, but the people, but the popularity, but the viral, uh, but, uh, you know, is going to trigger a lot of people. I don't care. Well, it triggers the, I see it triggers the, the people that we're, that we're fighting against right now. When they call it an anti-Semitic term, that's when I'm like, this is a slogan that I can get behind. And if, see, if I start to stream and I start playing music, like yeah. during Ramadan, I'm not doing that. We're not playing music. Um, we're trying not to. At You're least. a musician? I'm not a musician. But like when I start to stream, I start with music because oh. it's, you know, it draws people in. You know, even though it's not perfect, it's not Quran, it's not Sunnah, um, it still draws people in. And then, then you get to speak about what you talk about, then you get to give da'wah, then you get to, you know, try to bring people closer to God. Even though it's imperfect, is it, can it not still be effective? Even though I don't believe Christ is the king of all kings, even though it gets the, the right, it shows allegiance to the right people, I think Christians and Muslims are on the same side on a lot of issues right now. Can it not be effective to, to be imperfect, especially in social media, which is, you know, it's a, the whole existence of social media is imperfect? That's a very, that's a very deep question. And uh, you see, uh, nothing is perfect. Yes, you're right. Even my dawah, anybody's dawah. Is it perfect? No, we have some mistakes. Maybe it's not that effective the way I say things. Maybe the, 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 the subject that I use. But like I said again, it, it, see, anything in, in dawah, we call it in Arabic, uh, tawqifi. Okay. Tawqifi means from waqf, stop. Yani I have to be restricted in the, my method of dawah as the Prophet did. I can't come up with new methods of dawah. I'm not talking about tools. I can use whatever tools that are to technology, that's fine. I can use my phone, my camera, whatever, now what we're doing, this is fine. I'm talking about the method. So I can't come, for example, I can't say I'm going to give dawah by singing. It depends what he means by singing. There were companions who did poetry it is a form of dawah. So when he says tawqifiyah, what, what, what do you mean by that? Yes? Yeah, I understand but what he's saying, you know, that it's set, you cannot miss it, it's like salah. We know that it's set. Nobody can come and say we're going to add the extra uh, rakah to um, dhuhr and make it five rakah. No, we understand that. But you see how rigid they are. It's like, no, there were people, there were the companions who defended the honor of the Prophet, peace be upon him, spoke about tawheed in, in poetry. Yeah? Is, is that not a form of singing? I say that's not, that's not right, that's haram. And that's not how the Prophet ﷺ did, so you don't do it. Anything that was available at the time of the Prophet and he didn't use, then we don't use. You know what I mean? Right. Makes sense, right? Because what's the best da'wah? The Prophet's da'wah. That's the best. We follow that, the methodology of the da'wah. And so we have to restrict ourselves with that. Like, but not, I'm not going to get a lot of people to listen to me. We're not, we don't care about quantity, we care about quality. Not perfect, and it's not what the, obviously not what the Prophet ﷺ would do. Isn't this, what, isn't this method effective in the social media age? I'm not, I'm not denying that it's effective. It's very effective. But like I said, we have to draw the line. Like Christ is king, doesn't... That's sure. Does, is that really considered shirk? Yes, verbal shirk. It's not in your heart. But if I say, if I say Pharisees king. This is unbelievable. This is unbelievable. To say Jesus is king is shirk. And you are supposed to be a person of knowledge. Well, like, it, it just um, amazes me. You're supposed to be a person of, and same with uh, Sajid. These people were in Medina. And you say, it's just mind blowing. Bro, I'm the Jahil. I'm Ali needs dawah. At, at mind blowing. To say Jesus, Jesus is king is shirk. If you said Jesus is the king of all kings, you can say, okay, Christians use that to claim Jesus is the king. Like, literally, understandable. But to say Jesus is king is shirk. That's not shirk. I'm not worshiping you. You're just, like, what if I'm a king? If I tell the people watching, you guys are kings. That's fine. That's not, but you have, you have, uh, that's, that slogan is very well known and it's used by who? Only Christians. But like you wouldn't see anybody else but a Christian would say that and they mean something by saying that. And so that's why it's, it can be, it can be. I mean, True, but the slogan, Jesus is king of all kings, not Jesus is king. Christians use Jesus, the king of all kings. Every knee shall, knee shall bow. That's what they say. Not Jesus is king. Please understand that. But, but if my intentions are different and I don't mean that, then it's not sure. I'll give you an example. Okay. If you, if you swear by other than Allah, so I swear on my mother's life, is that shirk? The Prophet said it's shirk. A lot of Muslims do that. I hear that quite a bit, yeah. What kind of shirk? It's lesser shirk, minor shirk. It doesn't take you out of the folds of Islam. But you have committed a violation. If you believe that your mother is God, of course that's halal, it takes you out of Islam. I swear on my mother's life, I swear on my life, or whatever. The Prophet said, Man halafa bighayr, laqad ashak. Anybody who swears by other than Allah, then he has committed polytheism. And this is the type of shirk, it's a verbal shirk. So like I said, your actions has to be, two conditions have to be met. Your intention and your act. And so here, yes, you don't mean Christ is king. I'm sure that you don't mean that. But that statement is used by exclusively by Christians and it's meant. They, they mean Christ is the Lord, is the king of kings. I mean, there's nothing else I can say. I just, like I said, I, I tell every revert. Yeah, and I've told Sneeko this as well. And I say everybody, yeah, these three individuals, Sajid, Shamsi and Faris. Please. What I'm going to say is, look, like I said, be very careful. Yes. You will go down a toxic pathway, everything become rigid, everything becomes impermissible. And you know what's going to happen? You are going to end up losing your Islam. You're going to follow your deed because it's going to be like everything's this, that, you can't say nothing, etc. And I'm not saying you should. What I'm saying is Islam has um, many things in Islam is permissible. These people sadly make many things impermissible. Sadly, that's what they do. So what I'm just going to say is for, obviously Sneaker knows I've spoken to them privately. Alhamdulillah, um, uh, like I said before, bro, Alhamdulillah, there's many, many uh, people, actual people of knowledge that take knowledge from. Uh, bro, inshallah, like Sheikh Uthman Farouk, very balanced brother, uh, Alhamdulillah, uh, who follows the same methodology we do. Very balanced, uh, very fair, Alhamdulillah. Uh, stick to him, inshallah, and follow that. That's what I'm going to say, inshallah. I just wanted to make this reaction video because I found it so sad that he's there telling him things that acting as if that 
is the um, like like th there is no room for difference uh, of opinion or it's just that's you saying uh, Jesus is king of shirk it's unbelievable so like I said Sneaker I've spoken to you before but for you guys watching at home please please be careful who you take knowledge from knowledge please like serious people of knowledge go listen to Sheikh Tahir White Mufti Munir yes there's many many good brothers out there Alhamdulillah. so that's what I'm going to say from sisters uh, till next time uh, look after yourself inshallah to say Jesus is king was said due to a specific incident that happened etc and it is very very clear what was meant and we assume the best simple as that uh, that's all I have to say from sisters look after yourself inshallah uh, assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh the Prophet وسلم, said, whoever builds a masjid for the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Allah will build for him a similar house in Jannah. On that day where Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala tells us that our books will be given and every little atom weight of good deed you've done will be there. And imagine you see a mountain and you're like, what a lucky person. Which righteous person? And Allah says, this is for you. For me? Yes. What did I do? You allowed people to pray. You built a masjid. I never had the money to build a masjid to Allah. You helped, you gave towards it, and Allah gives you the reward of as if you've built it. Donate now, guys, and do not delay. And share the video for extra rewards.